How's everybody doing? All right, so we're gonna do the top eight things, or just eight things, that you can do during the lockdown. I'm not sure if where you guys are watching this from, but here in Michigan, we've been locked down for, I believe, a week now, over a week, and it looks like it's gonna go into almost the entire month of April. We haven't, it's not, that's my, that's my guess anyway. So, uh, some things that I've been doing, and I wanna share with you guys what you guys can do as well. I mean, you know, forced time off, all that good stuff, right? So, uh, the main thing for me, Lately, it's been getting organized, uh, cleaning out the trailer, you know, modifying a couple things since the last couple videos. Uh, truck, you know, if you got a you know, van, just a regular truck, you know, organization saves time and it absolutely um, <laughs> it makes you money if you know exactly what you have and you can put your hand on whatever tool you have when you need it, absolutely. So get organized, clean out, you know, just, just I'm st I still have to go deep clean, get everything reorganized. This whole area right here is uh, <laughs> next up on the list for sure. But uh, yeah, absolutely organization is key to any business and that's that's one thing I'm gonna be using some of my time on here. Um, next thing I would say, I mean, these are not in any specific order, so take for what it, what it is, but a uh, website, if you don't have one, maybe time to get one. Uh, or if you have one, work on it. Uh, I have mine, I actually been kind of lagging on because I'm gonna be changing business names and everything, so it's gonna be a completely new website, and that one's gonna be canceled. And uh, so I, I personally have not been doing that, absolutely. I'm not gonna, not gonna spend my time on it, but uh, website, Instagram, Facebook, if you have most, a lot of smaller guys, just have a Facebook page, no website, you know, take time to post on it, update it, um, you know, reach out to your, you know, prior and future customers, just let them know you're still around, um, just be present, and, you know, uh, every day, either, you know, Instagram, post something every day, every other day, as much as possible, you want to keep uh, your business name and yourself in front of all the people who follow you, for sure. Uh, I would say next thing maintenance on your truck trailer van uh, get that get those brakes done that you you know you know you need to oil changes um, but doing some uh, brake work and bearing work on the on the trailer prior but that was before this all happened so I'm pretty set on that as well but I know I need a tire I might go get a tire here pretty soon I know I need there's a couple things I'm gonna do on the truck uh, just to kind of organize it get it, you know get it, you know get everything working right So once this whole thing blows over, you know We can hit the ground running and absolutely knock out work because it's gonna be a cram session as far as work Because everybody's gonna want everything done right then because you know, we've been we've been out of we've been out of it for a while so Maintenance on your truck trailer van all that good stuff and just you know keep on it because obviously if you take care of your equipment It's gonna take care of you so I'll say another thing, uh, next thing would be, if you're not already, if you're just a chuck in the truck, uh, a truck in a chuck, whatever you want to call it, uh, get legal, you know, get yourself an EIN, uh, make an LLC, it's not that expensive, just get legal, make yourself a business, that way it's also for, li there's a lot of liability, for sure, get insurance, if you don't have insurance, get insurance, uh, licensing, in your, some states don't require it, but, you know, other states, you can only do certain, like $500 or $600, Michigan, it's $600, without a license, just, you know, get, get legal. I mean, co cover your butt, you know, make, you know, just there's a plenty of time to take any kind of course you need. I'm not gonna speak for every state, but um, you know, if, if we're out for a month, that's a lot of time. I know it's, it costs a little bit of money, but <clears throat> come on now, like the, I mean, the fines for it and all that kind of stuff, I would absolutely say get legal, uh, insurance, you know, all that good stuff. Just, you know, get your, it, is, it just helps your business in the long run, uh, makes you more legit, all that good stuff. I would say education would be the next one. Um, again, taking courses, something online you can do, some sort of certification. Uh, just you know, if you need to, if you need to do something around your house, you'll go tear something apart and put it back together just so you know how to do it. You know, watch a bunch of YouTubes to do how tos and you know practice. If you've never done a door before, maybe take out a door, go to your box store that are still open, grab yourself a pre-hung door and swap it out if you need to. A window, you know, all that kind of stuff. I'm just from my perspective. Um, I know I need a I need a garage door and a window, so we're gonna we're gonna eventually swap those out pretty soon. But uh, you know, if, if there's something around your house you can do, just you know, continue your education, broaden your you know range of services, and in practice, you know, if you're gonna be doing you know if you're gonna be working or if you're around the house board, practice on something, whether it be tiling, you know, whatever. Just you know, get familiar with your tools, you know, practice with your tools some more, because. I mean, nobody's really a master. I mean, come on, you can always, you can always be, you can always get better, right? So, uh, I'll say as far as bookkeeping, you know, revise your contracts. If you have a contract, this is one thing I'm going to be looking at as well. Um, go through it, revise it, add stuff that you've ran into, 
um, you know, covering your butt again, just, you know, it, it, whatever you can do to make sure that all, you know, minimize liability on your end, put in that, those stipulations for, you know, payment, stuff like that in your contracts, just revise and go through them with a fine, you know, fine tooth comb, make sure everything, all your T's and I's are dotted and crossed, just go right through them. Um, I mean, it just, yeah, and that goes with your QuickBooks too, that would be my number seven one. Uh, just I need to um, just go right through them get caught up with everything make sure your books are in complete 100% order and you know exactly where you stand uh, with every project with everything you know look at your numbers and see your profit and loss all that kind of stuff that way you know if you need to raise your prices uh, keep them the same or if there's certain jobs that are just not profitable for you and you want to actually you know forego them and just say hey no no more <laughs> so um, absolutely uh, you know QuickBooks or whatever you you guys use I mean that's what I use but you know just make sure you know if you can if you can you know cut certain costs certain ways you know it'll let you know if you're spending too much fuel going here or not no, right now nobody's spending any fuel that's why it's so cheap because nobody's going anywhere so but yeah QuickBooks will be the um, by number seven and number eight will be just take take time off rest um, you know enjoy time with family uh, I have been um, for sure it's been actually pretty nice and you know just you know take some time to decompress you, you know you've got nowhere to go anyway right so just enjoy the time with uh, yourself friends family um, and you know do you even pick up a hobby or do something besides work that way you guys kind of recharge your batteries and get ready um, for when <laughs> everything ends and you got to go back to work and everybody wants everything done at um, you know breakneck speed and you know where it just completely you know it's, it's gonna be it's gonna be crazy uh, as far as Mine, I've got you know the big uh, one, the, the two large jobs. One's kind of finishing up, the other one's still in the process. Um, and I've got three more jobs also waiting. One of them's pretty large as well, which is two minutes down the road, which is fantastic. Um, but all that work, you know, it's it's a lot. So I'm at a point where I think I'm going to be losing. Money. If I don't hire anybody, I'm going to be losing money. I can't afford not to hire anybody. So this is the one. This is the time where I'm going to need to hire some people, and we'll we'll go from there as well. So. Like and subscribe if you think I've earned it. I appreciate it, you guys. Stay stay safe out there. Um, enjoy this time if you're on lockdown. Um, make sure you you know you get your business you know ready to go, and ex expand your skill set. Whatever you need to do. I appreciate it. I'll see you guys on the next video.